Here is a DJI Neo's hidden gem feature, cruise control. If you can master this, you can achieve some amazing results. Cruise control can be added to any movement on the drone, i.e. forwards, going backwards, moving side to side, so sideways, left and right, upwards, rising, downwards, lowering, and turning to the left and turning to the right. But you need movement or momentum for cruise control to work or engage. To find and enable cruise control, click on these three dots on the top right of the screen and then the sub-menu will bounce down. Select the tab control and scroll down to the function, first press function key. And then set the single press for cruise control. And you can see the single press there is selected for cruise control. To start the cruise control, you press the function button on the top left of the controller once. And to stop the cruise control, you press the function button again once, or you can use the pause button here in the middle. Either or will stop cruise control. And then as we go into the fly the drone now and scroll the camera up before we start, you need momentum in a specific direction in order to enable cruise control. So in this example, we're going to fly forward. So I'm pushing the right stick forward and then I'm going to press the function button and I've enabled cruise control and it's going forward very slowly. Then to stop cruise control, I press either the function button or the pause button. If you press the function button without enough movement or momentum, you get this message coming up. Let's do another forward movement now. So pushing forward, I'm going to hit the cruise control. It's a little bit faster this time. And I'm going to hit the function button as I get closer to these bushes to stop it. Cruise control disabled. Now I'm going to show you the real power of cruise control. So I'm going to fly backwards. And this time I'm going to go forward like we did before and add another movement. So I'm going to fly forward, the right stick, the cruise control is enabled and then I'm going to use the left stick to rise as we fly forward and then press the function key to stop cruise control. The next hidden feature of cruise control is that you can hold it. So this time I'm going to use the left stick to push up and lock the cruise control in. So we're rising and we're going up. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pull the left stick down hard and the drone's going to come down and then I'm going to let it go and it's going to go back up again. So you can pull it down. So you're going in the opposite direction. But as soon as you release it, because cruise controls are still on, you'll go back in the rising direction. So I'll just pause the control now and we'll have another look at that. Here's a second example of holding. So we're flying forward now. I've enabled cruise control going forward. Now I'm going to pull the right stick down slightly, let it go again, and I'm going to pull it down hard now, the right stick down hard now, towards me, and the drone's going to come back. But cruise control is still enabled, still designed to go forward. So if I release the right stick now, the drone starts to go forward again. Now watch closely. I'm now going to use the left stick. So I'm going to pull the left stick down and the drone's going down towards the ground. And then I'm going to level it off for a short period of time. They're going to push the left stick up quite hard. And we're getting very close to these bushes now. So watch what I do now. I pull the right stick really hard back. Now, and that cruise control still enabled. It's still on. If I release the right stick now, the drone starts to go forward again in the same speed and the same pattern that it was going before. I'm going to repeat the two left stick movements. So pulling the left stick down quite hard, letting it run along the ground. And then I'm going to push the left stick up quite hard. And then we'll hit the, the function button to disable cruise control. Next, I'm going to show you some complex maneuvers. In this example, we're going to push the left stick up and enable the cruise control. And it's going slowly, so it's rising slowly. 
And then when it gets to the top where I want to get to, I'm going to pull it hard down with the left stick so it's bouncing. It's like a yo-yo effect. And if as I release it now, when I get close to the ground, the yo-yo effect takes place and it starts to rise. And then it'll keep rising slowly and then I'm going to pull the left stick down hard again and it's going to bounce down yo-yo down and then when I release it this time I'm actually going to push the right stick forward now so it's actually rising but also flying forward when I start pushing the right stick forward the drone starts to rise again so let's pull the left stick down hard let it go and then we'll disable cruise control the next one I'm going to show you is reverse flying backwards so let's pull the right stick down towards us and enable cruise control. So the drone is now flying backwards at a reasonable pace. And when it gets to the bottom here, I'm gonna push the right stick forward quite hard. And then if I release the right stick now, it's gonna yo-yo or start to cruise backwards again, which was the original direction. And then we'll disable the cruise control about here now. And finally, let's fly to the left and enable cruise control. So I'm pulling the right stick to the left and then I'm going to yo-yo back to the right, holding the right stick to the right, release it about here and it's going to just cruise back to the left as it did before. As it comes to the left of the hedge, I'm going to yo-yo it back to the right again and hold it, keep going to the right and then I'll release it and then we're going to cruise back to the left and then I'm going to disable the cruise control about now. The last one I'll do is fly to the right. So flying to the right and enable cruise control very slowly this time. Going to go and then I'm going to bounce it back to the left. Then disable cruise control for the last time. Hope this video about the cruise control has been helpful. If you want to see more videos, subscribe to the channel. Happy flying. Bye for now.